guys, it's Madame Wario. Welcome back to more Saturday morning cartoons. Um, we are still playing Pokemon because this has become like the longest running Saturday morning cartoons because I keep skipping a week because of weird, unexplainable reasons. So let's let's go. We're gonna start with the river because we haven't seen this yet. Um Oh no, yeah, we've seen the valley. I was like, wait, have we seen this? So, anyway, oh no, that's not the right button. What's up, Poliwhirl? Or Poliwog, just kidding. Um, you'd think I'd know which one's which. I've only known Pokemon, like, my whole life. Um, alright, so anyway, um, last time I had the poll about, you know, Mewtwo versus Mew. Um, you know what? You suck. Fine. Don't come see me. Um, and I was actually surprised by how many people, like, prefer Mewtwo. Um, it's kind of funny. Um, but then again, I'm, I'm girly and I like girly things. Um, so, <laughs> I just hit him in the face and he didn't do anything. Um, so of course I'm going to like um, Mew best. Hello, I still have my my Mewtwo Pokemon card. I don't have my Mew card anymore. Oh no! Come back, Magikarp. Maybe. Okay, I guess not. I'm like not taking pictures of anything. I used to play the Valley for hours though, like trying to figure everything out. Same with my sisters. Anyway, a lot of you like the original games, too. The, the original, you know, red, blue, yellow, if you will. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa, Metapod. He's gonna be like, I can't tell what that is. You blocking my path, dude. Hey, come here. I'm trying to hit you! Yeah. No! Dang it. Okay, well, whatever. Um, Psyduck! I like you! I used to have a stuffed animal with Psyduck. Um, you know, it's like a tough call. I say this with so many things, uh, that you almost have to love the original, um, just because it's what got you hooked in the first place. Um, but sometimes, like, the the sequels are just, like, amazing, though, because then, um, Nintendo gets the chance to make things better. Oh, that was nifty. Um, just kind of like I like to use the example with Mario Party. My personal favorite Mario Party is Mario Party 1, but most people, I feel like, um, I feel like most people say that Mario Party 2 is their favorite. And I mean, that was a sequel, but um, sometimes there are just things you... <laughs> so great. Uh, sometimes they're just like, um, you know, the Nintendo... Is that really the winning picture of Poliwog? His butt? What? Okay, whatever, that's stupid. Anyway, um, okay, what was I saying? Oh yeah. Um, you know, sequels of movies, like Disney movies and stuff, they just use it for money, I feel like. It's like, oh, um, you know, we could make more money off of this because it's so popular, so let's try. That, that is seriously the worst picture that I've ever nice. seen. Whatever, I'm saving this hideous one. Um, oh, it's gonna be a tad closer. Boo, you suck. Anyway, um, so when, when a, um, when a sequel's made for a movie and it's just for the heck of, you know, making money, it's never good. It's never any better. But in games, uh, they, I feel like they close. use it better. Like, you are close. Whatever, you're stupid. Um, anyway, I feel like they use it better because, um, they actually use sequels to make things in the game more advanced or, you know, 
um, evolve the Welcome game with back. that. It's not like, oh, we just wanted money, we're gonna do this. I mean, sure, that kind of comes with it, but whatever. Um, I just feel like um, yes. Nintendo has a better grasp of doing that. Um, and same goes with the Pokemon games. You know, for as much as I love Red and Blue, I'm a dork who loves, like, the daycare of gold and silver, and I love how there's, um, you know, just so many things in it. Um, like, Goldenrod City, I love that whole thing with the, um, why don't you have any eyes? Ditto! That's why. I forgot about that. Um, like, I love the whole thing with, uh, all the little side stories like that that were more involved in, like, silver and gold. Um, and then I said that Sapphire is probably, like, my favorite. I think that part, part of that reasoning is because, um, with Sapphire, I wasn't really expecting anything. I didn't have much of an expectation other than it would probably not be as good as the other two. Um, and, you know, when I played it, I got so addicted to it. It was like, oh my god, this is like the best thing ever. Um, and I was really surprised. And it had all those elements in it, plus more. So that made me, you know... Um, that made me really happy. Hey, come back, Julie Puff. You're my favorite. Um, that made me really happy just to see that they'd taken the elements I liked and just kind of advanced them even more when I thought, you know, they probably would be totally different. I don't know. It's it's an interesting discussion. Um, wait, Jiggle, come back, Jiggly. You're all happy and stuff! Okay, well, anyway. Um, so yeah, I really, really, really love Sapphire. Um, something I love that they added in Sapphire was, um, I think I talked about this last time, but the dive element of going into the deep part of the ocean, and it played that really twinkly music that was just, like, super great. Like, I loved that. That was... 100% fantastic. Oh, I forgot about this. What am I supposed to do? I forget what I'm supposed to do. But I forget a lot of this game, so whatever. Um, so I love the dive element. I love the beauty contest element that makes like your Pokemon happy or whatever. And uh, The whole way they designed that I really was a fan of. Oh my god! It's Jigglypuff's song! Yay, you're so good! <laughs> she gets so angry. Jigglypuff is so upset. Um, Jiggly's my favorite. Anyway. So I just wanted to kind of point those things out for the sake of the games because I didn't really have much of a chance to elaborate on um, any of those subjects last time. There's no way that's going to get it, but whatever. Um, and we don't have all three Jigglypuffs, so... Sucky! Um, okay, well, anyway, I wanted to move on to... Um, kind of some memories I have of the show and some of the more recent sh episodes of the show. Um, you know what? In the more recent episodes, I can't tell. Like, I, r I really can't tell. Ooh, double my score. Hey. Whatever. Um, I can't tell if half the characters are guys or girls, because they look like trannies, and then they talk like trannies. They walk like trannies, and they act like trannies. Bottom line, I don't know what the gender of- Oh my god, my picture won! Yes! He was faint and looked like crap! That was the one that I said wouldn't get it, and it did. Well, anyway, Jigglypuff on stage! Jigglypuff on stage is worth 500 points. Oh, well, you know 
what? He's gonna be like, you <gasps> suck. There were three in that one. Ah! That made me run out. I don't know why. It was just so boring. I'm kidding. Aw, 6 4 3 0. I don't really know what that means, but whatever. Um. Okay, let's save the old one. Um. So I guess we'll play one more and I'll talk about some of the memories I have. Um, these go back to probably some of my favorite years of my childhood, which were in middle school. Um, that was probably like the best year. Let's play the beach again, because yes. I like the beach. Um, and it's summery out, so yay. Anyway. Uh, dang it, I tried to hit that. Me and one of my best friends used to watch Pokemon every single day back then because, like, no one really watched it as much anymore at that time. And, um, so we'd watch it and we had so many inside jokes about it because it was just like, no one watched it, no one knew what we were talking about. Um, and it just developed into this really, you know... Uh, pretty pimp time that we had together. Oh no, I hit you, and you didn't do anything. Okay, let's go fast. What up, Snore? I can't tell what Snore likes is. That was cute with the Butterfree. Oh, Meowth, you're so happy! Um... So, what was I talking about? Um... Lapras! Come closer! Anyway. Um... We would always come up with so many inside jokes about the show, and, um... I don't remember what season it was, um... But it seems like every episode we watched was about, uh, James, and he was, like, my favorite character, because he's such an idiot. Um, but I just remember watching that so many times with her, um, and it was so much fun to- <laughs> Did we just hit Meowth? Okay, I guess we almost did. Um, it was so much fun to watch that, and that was around the time of Sapphire, which might have some contribution to why I loved it so much. I actually think that that was um, one of the reasons why I loved uh, Sapphire so much too, because that must have been the show then. The show must have been Sapphire. Um, what's up? I think I had a holographic card of you. Whatever. Um, so yeah, I was I was very happy with that whole time period. Um, so I think that kind of contributes to why I liked Sapphire so much. Um, but really, I'm like out of time now, kind of. We'll probably have enough time to go through this, though, so let's put Oak's Mark on this picture, and this one of Chansey's butt, and this one of Kangaskhan. Isn't it crazy how no matter how long you go without watching Pokemon, you still remember all the names? It's like the Pokemon songs. You can go like 10 years without listening to that CD, and the second you pop it in again, you know all the words. It's like, wow, I didn't forget any of this. Epic. Um, it seriously is like that, because I'll, I'll like say these names, and I'm like, how in the world did I remember that? How does anybody remember that name if you're not like in it? It's crazy. I'm just like, I don't know. I always found that interesting though. Oh, her butt didn't win. Whoa! It was so epic. She's so angry. Whatever, you suck. Um, alright! Well, you guys, that's all the time I have for this weekend. Next weekend, because this is the third time we've seen Pokemon, there will be a brand new cartoon. 
or there could be a returning cartoon with a new game. So um, keep that in mind. Thanks for watching, guys. Let me know any of your last thoughts on Pokemon, and I will see you next weekend. Peace out.